Seven years after Hurricane Katrina literally changed the face of New Orleans and scarred the soul of Americans, the famed city's rebound remains a work in progress. To be sure, New Orleans was a city with problems before the levees gave way, but today, coffee shops, art galleries, and restaurants stand on streets that before the storm were ridden with crime and neglect. Today, startup companies are flocking to New Orleans, and a city once known for jazz and Mardi Gras is now a hub for tech startups and other new businesses. For all the new development and talk of a new start for New Orleans, some of the historic problems remain. It has the highest murder rate in the nation. There are about 40,000 abandoned buildings across the city, and some estimates say one in every four homes in New Orleans remains vacant. Improvement seems to have skirted residents of the Lower Ninth Ward, the poor neighborhood hit hardest by the storm. Generation after generation has changed the face and architecture of the ward, but today large parts are overgrown with vegetation, and residents say that New Orleans was, and still is, a tale of two cities.